title of this video right here, you guys, is going to be, there is no such thing as ugly. Okay? Physical ugliness. There is no such thing as that in human form. Okay? And I'm going to start this off because I see us a lot of people around the world that suffer with self-esteem issues. You know, a lot of people have a hard time looking at the person in the mirror. You know? And they don't really accept the person that they see in the mirror. You know, I want you guys to know that what the most high makes is good, you know, and no man can battle against what the most high says. Okay. Now we see all kinds of ideals of beauty being promoted to us in the media, magazines, billboards, commercials, everywhere that you go, you see beauty, what society deems to be beautiful. And there's a lot of us out there that feel like we don't fit what society thinks is beautiful. So we lack on ourselves. Or better yet, we try to change ourselves to fit society standards. You know? But I want you guys to know, first and foremost, when you be seeing people that people call ugly, they're just not groomed. Okay? Grooming is very important, you guys. Okay, when you're fresh, when you're clean, you know, you're smelling good, and you're wearing fresh, clean clothes, I don't think you guys understand how much more attractive you appear when you're fresh and you're clean. You know? Keeping up on yourself. It's important in life because it makes you feel better about who you are. You know? When you start lacking on yourself, you stop taking showers. Because I'm speaking from my own personal experience on this. Because there's people out there that I get compliments from some people from time to time. You know? But there was a point in my life, you guys where I did not keep up on myself, you know, was very depressed, was just down and out, you know, funky, <laughs> just crazy. And a lot of you guys, not the treatment that I got was so much worse. <laughs> it was terrible, you know, when you're in this place of darkness, where you're not really loving yourself. Because let me tell you guys something. There's no way that you can say you love yourself if you're abandoning yourself every day. You're not keeping up on you. You know? So I had a lack of love for myself during that period of time. So I had a lack of hygiene and a lack of grooming, which made me appear a little unsettling on the eyes. You know? people judge you for that because how you appear is what makes other people that's what gives people a good idea of who you are internally to some extent it's when they see how you present yourself you know you walking around with dirt stains all over you period stains on the back of your pants dookie stains in your underwear all of that how do you think your energy is going to be when you go amongst people it's going to be low vibrational, you know? You're going to be emitting a lower frequency. You feel me? And the reason why you're going to be emitting a lower frequency is because not only are you feeling terrible on the inside, but now you're looking terrible on the outside, you know? And that's unattractive. That's ugly. You know what I'm saying? That's when people look at you and you might be like this. Walking down the street. You know? Next thing you know, you, you mean mugging people. Like, people that people that looking all nice and stuff like that. You walking down the street. You looking at them. 
you mean lugging them and shit like that because you don't even really feel good about yourself. That's making you unattractive. And then you end up with a bitterness. So keep up on yourself. You know? The Most High did not make your flesh to rot. You know what I'm saying? It's like shining a trophy up every day. You know? Keep up on yourselves. You know? I actually love looking at new people. I love meeting new people every day. You know? Because you get to see the creator's art through different people. Everybody has a different face. Even if you have somebody out here that look alike, they're still different. You know what I'm saying? They just happen to look similar. You know, the iPhone 6 is not the same as the iPhone 7. They're the same company, and they come from the same company, same manufacturer, but they have different features. You know, and that's how humans are. You know? Love you for who you are. Don't allow society to tell you this is how you should look. That's how you should look. You know, grow into you. Stay up on yourselves. You know? Hygiene is very important. Like, just making sure that you're clean and you're good. Like, that's what makes you attractive. When you feel good internally, it's going to manifest externally. You know? No such thing as ugly. You guys drop your thoughts and opinions in the comment section what you think about this video. This is going to be like a little spoken word for you guys because I have all kinds of thoughts throughout the day that I have about society. And it's just some things that really sticks with me. You know, people look down on people because they're going through certain periods in their life. You know, and I'm telling you guys, like when people are down, they can look different. You know what I'm saying? Like when people are down and out, they can look just totally different. They won't even look like the same person that they grow into over time. But stay up on yourselves. You feel me? You guys, drop your thoughts and opinions in the comment section what you think about this video. You guys stay strong, stay glorious, and stay beautiful. This is Electrifying Vibrations. Shalom.